Well, hello to all of you shooters and reloaders out there. It's Fortune Cookie, 45 LC, coming to you from the Hot Lead Zone Express. And, and also to the great Three Circles members, thank you for being members of the Patreon site, Three Circles. Today, we're going to talk about a book. This is the sixth edition, so a lot of you out there probably have some of the previous editions. I've never had any editions of this book. It's called Propellant Profiles. And what it is is a collection of all these articles all about the various powders that are available to reloaders today. With the exception of Hodgen 777. It's not in this book. But this book goes up to 2016. So why it doesn't include Hodgen 777 is a mystery that's beyond me. But anyway, it's a good book because it's got all the other powders in there. Including a lot of black powders and black powder like Pyrodex and this kind of thing. But I'll tell you how this book came to my possession, and that is Doug, my friend and, and mentor who actually started me in reloading, decided that he wanted to take a trip up to Oroville, California to visit RCBS. And sure enough, he got there and actually had a little tour of the factory. He said, there's not a lot there. You go in, there's an office, and then the rest of the building is a factory, and they have a small museum, but that's it. But uh, it's an amazing place that you can see all that manufacturing being done. But anyway, he also had a great time going to Huntington, which is right next to RCBS in Oroville. And Huntington is a big outdoors shooting and reloading emporium. Hunting, all that kind of stuff. It's a great place for all of us to visit that, that love the shooting sports. Anyway, he went to Huntington and he was checking out the books that they had there. And when he saw this, he thought of me and said, you know what, I'm going to get this book for Steve. And so when he saw me, he presented me with this book. It's by Wolf Publishing. And it's got a number of different authors in there. But it's got 557 pages, all chock full of powder and powder information. You want to know, for instance, about Accurate Arms number no. nine powder? They got a, they got a picture of the granules. Tells you all about that. Tells you the content of the powder was made up of. Is it single base, double base? If it's double base, how much nitroglycerin is in a powder? For instance. I bet a lot of you didn't know that the powder that we use so much of, and that's a Liant Unique, it's actually 40% nitroglycerin. So that's a lot of nitroglycerin. And that explains why a lot of us think that Unique is such a dirty powder. Because the more nitroglycerin that there is in there, the more stabilizer they got to add to the powder to keep that nitroglycerin good. And that stabilizer it's kind of like dirt. When you burn the powder, you get all this smoke and, and this soot and powder residue. And a lot of us uh, have been complaining about Unique for all these years, but that's the reason. However, we like Unique so much, we use it anyway. If any of you out there have any questions about powder, then give me a question under comments, especially if you go to the three circles and put the comment in there. All viewers open house videos. So you can make comments there. And uh, I'll be sure to see it. And I'll be able to answer it from this book. This book fills in a lot of the gaps about gunpowders that we didn't know before. So uh, thanks to Doug again for this great gift. And uh, yeah, he spent quite a bit of money to, to buy this thing. And I appreciate that. So take care. Just thought I'd drop you a fast video on this book. Propellant Profiles, the Wolf Publishing Company out of Prescott, Arizona. Bye for now.